Before setting up the heaters and fans in the room, please watch our instructional video on how to prep your room for the heat treatment. Welcome to our heater setup and usage instruction video for bed bug heat treatments. Similar instructions are also available as a downloadable PDF on our website. Before using our heat treatment equipment, please carefully follow all of the instructions in this video and in the PDF. You will want to point your heater at the place in the room where there is the highest concentration of bed bugs, typically the head or foot of the bed. Place the fan so that a current of heated air flows in a circular motion. You can use the walls to help propel the air as needed. Please make sure nothing is touching the heater or the fans once they are turned on. Also, please make sure no electronics are directly in front of the heater. Plug in the heater. Locate four different 15 amp or 20 amp circuits, not just four different outlets, for each plug of the heater. You may need to use nearby hallways, bathrooms, or additional rooms to achieve this. We provide you with four extension cords to help with this. Plug in the fans. All fans, the black power cords, can be plugged into any available outlet. They do not need their own circuit. Starting the equipment. Make sure that all equipment is plugged in all the way to ensure continued heat. All the lights on the equipment and the ends of the extension cords should be lit. Turn on the standalone fans. Then turn on the fan on the heater, which is the green switch, and then the heater, which is the red switch. The heater is preset to 132 to 135 degrees Fahrenheit. This should be sufficient to treat your room. Do not leave the heater on without the fan running. Monitor the room. You will have an infrared laser spectrometer pistol that will show you the temperature of objects in the room. Take readings every few hours until the objects reach the temperature of at least 130 degrees Fahrenheit. Make sure to check the corners of the room as well as any other areas that are farthest from the heater. Check the temperature of drawers and closets and in between the mattress and box springs. Once you see readings of 130 degrees Fahrenheit in the hardest to reach spots, continue to treat for a minimum of 18 more hours. You do not want to rush this. Typical treatment time from start to finish can take 24 hours. Cool down. Once the room has been heated to the proper temperature for the desired time, 20 to 24 hours, the heaters and fans can be shut off. Shut the heater off first. Do not leave the heater on without the fan running. It is best to allow the room to cool down slowly in order to reduce damage to items, furniture that could be damaged if rapidly cooled. You will want to stay out of the treatment area for several hours after the heater is turned off. Additional precautions. Once the room has been cooled, wash the linens on high heat and then dry on a full high heat cycle as an extra precaution. Now that you have set up the heat treatment equipment, you are ready to eliminate your bed bug problem. Thank you for using New England's only do-it-yourself bed bug heater rental company.